I got into farming as like uh, from my, my parents. They had to farm, and so I just jumped in and started doing it. Right up here. I pretty much grow um, any green leafy vegetable like kale, collard, mustard, turnip, uh, arugula, uh, Swiss chard. Uh, then I do uh, tomatoes, bell peppers, cucumbers, green beans, okra, and what they call uh, cow peas. I, I, I deal all my product that I grow here at, at several farmers markets within the area. This area, Salanti, Detroit, uh, downriver from Detroit, some of the suburbs of Detroit, and um, that's that's pretty much how I, I how I uh, make my living is, is selling the produce that I raise at farmers markets. I, I just want to put in a word about farmers markets. How great I think they are because I've been doing them for about 20 years. And I think that for a small grower like me, you know, this is this farm is 40 acres, but it's only 21 acres that I can really use. In fact, with uh, some of these sandy areas, I, you know, it's even less than that. But anyway, for a small grower like myself, the farmer's market offers me an excellent opportunity to market my product. I mean, I, it's not like I'm selling to a chain store where they want quantity, quantity, quantity. I can take a, a, a moderate amount of produce that I can, can grow on this ground and, and, uh, and make a good living out of doing it, you know. I, I'd have to I have to sell everything retail. I couldn't I don't you know like wholesale by the bushel or anything like that. But from time to time, you know, sometimes people ask me for bushels of green beans or something like that, or the field peas. But mainly, uh, the farmers markets offer me a really good way to make a living doing this kind of thing. I don't think I really would do it any other kind of way here. And it's, and it's something I enjoy. So you know. I like selling directly. A, a small grower has to, I have to sell directly to the people. I can't go through a broker or anything like that, a third or middle person like that to, to, um, it would, you know, it would cut so much into my profits. You know, so when I can sell directly to the consumer, that's the great thing. And I think the consumer really appreciates it because this is nice farm fresh stuff. Like I got a farmer's market to go to tomorrow, Thursday. This is Wednesday, and. I tell them every, every, when I go, this stuff was either picked the day before or the same day that I come to market. People advertise fresh farm, fresh, but it, <laughs> you can't get it any fresher than this. And that's what I focus on. And I think people appreciate me doing that. And uh, that's, that's part of the incentive of doing this other than, you know, the economic factor. But, you know, I, I think it gives people a good feeling and, uh, and it makes them feel good about having stuff right from the grower. Well, I find that consumers, young and old, of all racial categories and cultural groups are concerned more about where their food is coming from and what they eat. And I'm not, I'm not uh, averse to, to, to the line with that information. I think that's great. You know?